Hey guys and welcome back to my channel. Today I am doing one of my first actual affordable builds. Um, my builds are usually quite expensive so with this one I tried to keep it under 20,000 and the weird thing about this house is I don't know if it was a glitch or I don't know but when I built it it told me that it was 17,000 simoleons and then I decided to move a sim in here and then it sold for 16,000 simoleons and then I put it in the gallery and it showed 15,000 simoleons. So when you guys download it, it'll probably be the gallery price at 15,000, but I, I don't know. I didn't change anything in the house between doing all that stuff. So I don't know why the price changed, but um, the title says it's 17,000, but I think in the gallery, it is actually 15,000 simoleons. So <laughs> either way, you will be able to download this right away, um, have your sim move in, and they should still have some extra money. I wanted to keep this house simple, but I wanted the outside to look really nice. I didn't do too much landscaping, there's not a lot of clutter in the inside. I wanted to keep it as simple as possible while still having some color and personality. So I really ended up loving this build, and I never use like, um, roof decorations like the fireplace so I try to do something a little bit different there. I try to get out of my comfort zone. Usually I like big houses and I just changed it up. I did something small and I really like how it turned out so I might be doing more starter homes. Um, this is on the gallery like I said. I think it's at 15,000 right now. It should be unless something changed and it went back to 17,000. I, I don't know. Let me guys know if that's ever happened to you because I have not had that happen ever. So yeah, it was a little bit weird. And you guys will notice that I actually did not do a really expensive kitchen either. I really love doing large kitchens with the best appliances and a lot of countertops and what are they called? Cabinets? <laughs> I forgot the word for a second. But I do like doing really large kitchens and so this one I tried really hard to keep it simple especially because I did not have a lot of room in this area because I also wanted to put a living room, living space in here. So I didn't do all of the cheapest furnishings. Um, most of them are but some of them I did like the next one up. So they are cheaper and they're not the most expensive. So that's what makes this house so cheap. But I do think it looks actually pretty nice. Like I would move a sim in here for a challenge or a legacy or anything. I think this is a perfect starting home. We only have three minutes left to talk here. And this is pretty much all I have to say about the build. It is very simple, just a starter home. Um, nothing too complex to really talk about here. I've already mentioned everything that I think is important. So I am going to go ahead and end the voice over here for today. Do not forget to subscribe if you are not already subscribed. Click that button and go ahead and like this video if you enjoyed watching and let me know what you thought about it in the comments and whether or not you are going to download it. Anyway, thank you guys so much for watching and I will talk to all of you later.